how to set up Wix events page. Hello guys and welcome to this new tutorial. In today's video, I'm going to show you how simple and easy it is to set up a Wix events page to organize your events and different type of, let's say, uh, presentations or um, let's say internal uh, events that are going to have into a specific uh, placement or into the online um, consultations. So it is going to be very easy and simple. We are going to head over at Wix.com, sign in for an account, and here we are going to see the dashboard. Now, once you are going to be here, select the website that you want to add that specific feature for. I'm going to select this website, wait for the dashboard of it to um, reveal, as you can see like that. Now, what are we going to do? Next is going to be very simple. Normally, we are going to find the events from here, but here we are not going to find it because I haven't added the page and also I haven't set it up. So how we can set it up, basically click on design site or edit site from the setup or homepage. Now, once you have did that, you're going to find your website. Now, what are we going to do is going to be very simple. We are going to head over to the left side of the screen. As you can see, we are going to click on add apps, click on it. And we are going to be uh, waiting for the app store to load up. Now from here, we are going to type in Wix events like that. So basically the uh, app is going to be called uh, Wix events and tickets. And we are going to find it like this. So this is the official app. So basically what we're going to do is to click on add to site. And then we're going to uh, wait for the app to load up and wait for it to install. So this is uh, going to be uh, the most simple thing that we can do. We're going to wait for a few seconds and normally it is going to open up the event page automatically like that. Now, what can we do or what are we going to do is going to be very simple. So from here, this is the page and for the events, they are going to be uh, here. As you can see, we have some examples. Now, the best thing that we can do right now is going to be here, click on event or manage events. And from here we can add manage also organize the events. As you can see, this is going to be a tab for the dashboard of the website. As you can see on the left side of the screen where I have mentioned that we should see the event, uh, as you can see mentioned here, which is, it is right now. We're going to find the, um, as you can see, the options like the published uh, events, the drafts, categories, staff, and etc. So we have the options like uh, having an event app and also the app center. And also we can go ahead and add an event from here. So we can um, put or categorize the event as a um, ticketed one or an RSVP, which is going to be for a, so let's say, waitlist and invitations. So choose your type from here, put the general info, like the event name, short teaser, add the category of the event and also an event image or the illustration of it. And uh, here we can go ahead and set up the date, time, uh, and you can see that we can go ahead and put a start and end date, time zone, the display, which is going to help you show and uh, the end uh, and also the start date. Uh, the location, you can go ahead and put a location or a physical location by putting the address, online location or TBT, TBD or to be decided later. And finally about the event, which is going to be a brief explanation about it. When you finish, you're going to create it as a draft and you're going to publish it at the end of the mission. So basically you're going to have the page from here and you're going to let the clients or the visitors of the websites to have a, um, let's say an uh, introduction to that event. So they can go ahead and click on RSVP or reservate from here. For the page itself, how you can access it, it is going to be uh, very simple. You're going to head over the left side of the screen, click on pages and menu. Now we are going to find site menu, sign up and login, booking, uh, pricing plans and everything. So basically what are we going to do or, or what can we do is going to head over the event pages from here and we can go ahead and have it from right there. Now you can see that normally we are going to find the site menu from here. You can go ahead and add a menu item and you're going to 
add a new page and that page is going to be uh, related to that event page so that was pretty much it for today's video thank you guys for watching i hope that you have enjoyed the content and i hope to see you soon on the next one